No. Two. No. Knowing how to defend yourself and knowing how to get away from an attacker. Once you are in that fight and once you have chosen to resist, you want to keep giving it 110%. To do that, Heather Reeves is teaching women, myself included, how to protect themselves with rape aggression defense techniques, also known as RAD. This is not sugar coating. I mean, we, we call it what it is, rape aggression defense. We're defending against somebody coming after you, potentially sexually assaulting or raping you. These basic moves don't require weapons. Reeves says they lay the groundwork for personal protection, requiring you to use things you already have, your head, hands, elbows, knees, and feet. You're also learning how to position yourself, effective targets and strategies. They are finding that piece of themselves that says that they don't have to be a victim, that they don't have to find themselves in a position where they they don't have control. When you come through with the strike, you want to come through. One move, a hammer fist Oof. to the forearm. Say, for instance, an attacker grabs you by the wrist or arm. Reeves says no. this hit to that vulnerable no. spot no. will cause them to let go. No! Allowing you to get away. But that's just one possible scenario. If you're approached from behind, if you can move your arms, you can use your elbows to aim for other vulnerable spots, like the person's side and stomach, or their head. No! Now, if your arms are being held down, Reeves says a good option is to use your foot. Aim for the shin, scrape down, then stomp down as hard as you can. The more different reactions you can have, and um, you can really kind of process that information a little bit faster the more, the, the more preparation you do. My biggest takeaway is to always have a plan and don't panic. If one move doesn't work, Reeves says you can't stop. Keep fighting and look for every opportunity to escape. Throw another punch, throw a knee, throw a, you know, throw a kick. Whatever it is that you have availability for, you want to make sure that you're making it count and you want to keep going. Never give up.